Here are 10 interesting tidbits on Disney's animated movie Fantasia. First, did you know that Fantasia was released in 1940? It was Walt Disney's third feature-length animated film after Snow White and the Seven Dwarfs and Pinocchio. The movie was a unique experiment. It featured classical music pieces performed by the Philadelphia Orchestra conducted by Leopold Stokowski. Disney animated the stories and characters to accompany the music. Another interesting fact is that Fantasia was the first film to introduce stereophonic sound in theaters called Fanta Sound. It had different audio tracks playing through multiple speakers, which were required to be installed before playing Fantasia. This gave a more immersive experience to the audience and was precursor to modern surround sound. The famous segment of Fantasia, The Sorcerer's Apprentice, starring Mickey Mouse, was initially planned to be a standalone short, but Disney decided to include it in the film. The Rite of Spring segment of the movie, which tells the story of the creation and extinction of dinosaurs, was one of the most technically challenging segments to animate. It required realistic depictions of the creatures and their movements. Interestingly, the original version of the Sorcerer's Apprentice segment featured a darker ending, in which the sorcerer would have punished Mickey for his misuse of magic. However, it was changed to have a more optimistic ending, in which the sorcerer forgives Mickey. Fantasia is unique in that it has no real dialogue or narrative, and each segment is self-contained. This made it a groundbreaking film, as it was not typical of the animated films of the time. The Dance of the Hours segment, featuring anthropomorphic ballet of ostriches, hippos, elephants, and alligators, is a favorite of many fans of the movie, and it has been parodied and referenced in popular culture over the years. The film was not initially a commercial success partly due to the high production costs of the movie and the fact that it was released in the midst of World War II, when many theaters were closed. Lastly, Fantasia has since become a beloved classic, and its impact on the animation industry and the use of music in movies is still being felt today. The movie has also inspired many artists and musicians over the years, and its legacy continues to live on. And there you have it, 10 interesting tidbits about Disney's animated movie Fantasia. We hope you enjoyed learning about this groundbreaking film. Thank you for watching. More to come.